Hey, what's up guys? My name is Bull6David and today I'll show you how to enable Steam Guard on the Steam desktop app. So let's get started. I will search for my for my Steam app and that's a very good way to increase security. But damn it, it opened on my on my second monitor. All right. Um, once you get here, <laughs> you'll have to press on this one. I recommend you to get the codes by email, not on the Steam app, because it, just in case something bad happened to your phone or your, or the app, yeah, there will be some complications. But how do you get here? Well, let's see. We are in the library right now. Is my profile working right now? Because two episodes earlier, it does. Okay, okay, leave it like as, as it is. So. To enable the Steam Guard, we'll have to go to the Steam in the top left corner and find the settings. And now we'll have to go to our account, which is the first one. And here you can find account details. I will press on that one. And from here, um, let me see where was that. Manage Steam Guard. So it will be the third one, account security. Let's press on St uh, manage Steam Guard and this is how you get here as you can see mine is turned on right now it's not turned off you may have this one selected um you will have to press on this one then you will have to get a code from the email you will set put a code there then you will have to sign out and sign in into your account and that's it if it's not working just restart your computer after you put a code and everything should be just fine just sign in and every time you will sign in into your account from 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 now on, after you set this, you will receive a code via email if you set this. But if you select the first one, you will get some authenticator on the app on the smartphone. This is the best level of security they they say. But in my opinion, yeah, maybe. But because somebody might get into your e uh, email, let's say. But nobody can get in onto, onto, into your smartphone, which is located on, in, into your pocket. But there will be complications if something bad happened to that app. So this is why I will not recommend you selecting the first one and getting on the on the email. It's much, much easier to remember that password to create a like a 15, 20 characters password. Much safer, in my opinion. Now, guys, that was it about this tutorial. I really hope I help you about this uh, Steam Guard tutorial. Subscribe for more Steam guides and leave a comment if you have any questions. I want to wish you one more thing. Have the greatest day you can have.